there is a use for those normally discarded wine corks. An unusual boat made out of 160,000 corks has completed a 17-day voyage down the Jura, one of Portugal's most famous rivers, with its US builders tired but exultant. John Pollock, the initiator of the trip, said he had expected the 265-kilometre trip down the river to take a week. Instead, Pollock and a crew of family and friends needed 17 days of almost constantly rowing the 1600k boat against headwinds on the slow-moving river. The Juro runs through the heart of northern Portugal's famed port wine industry. Polak, who had collected about 70,000 corks over 30 years to help build the vessel, scrounging many from Washington bars and restaurants. He said he was thrilled that his lifelong dream had come true. Designed by apprentice Washington architect Garth Goldstein, the seven metre long boat is made of wine corks banded together into slabs and then lashed onto logs with fishnet and cord. He and Pollock have said they believe the boat to be the first built entirely of corks. The vessel has a two metre high bow like a Viking ship, a V-shaped stern, wooden decking and a mast. It also has two pairs of oars. Pollock added that he planned to write a book about the boat. The crew thanked the people who helped them on their journey. A cork distributor, Cork Supply USA, furnished enough corks to complete the boat and helped ship it from the United States. The boat will remain with the company in Portugal, which is the world's biggest producer of cork.